Bust the damn family. Welcome back to the Real Extraction Channel on YouTube. It's your boy Sean. We here with another banger for y'all, man. So look. We got Bill Burr, man. You know, I, ha I had to come back for the Bill Burr again, bro. This stuff is just, it's too good, man. It's too good, bro. And I'm like so mad. I never really watched none of this. I ain't really mad I ain't watched it because I'm getting paid for it now. So it's cool. But like, bro, I don't know how all this, like Bill Burr, all these stand-ups just like bypass me my whole life, dog. I cannot, not play. But anyways, man, this is a highly requested reaction. It's, uh... Plastic surgery and lotion. It was really like some people need lotion, but I don't think that video is on YouTube no more So I got like a slightly longer version. It's like plastic surgery and lotion. So hopefully it's not too much extras But it's everything that we need and uh, Shit, that's pretty much it man about to check this out Hopefully y'all enjoy it if you do and you want to see more y'all know what to do hit that like button hit that subscribe button Let me know more Bill Burr reactions in the comments um, You can also post other comedians any other stand-ups you want me to do, man, I'll watch these all day. As long as it ain't getting blocked on YouTube or nothing, I'll watch these all day for y'all. So let me know what's going on in the comments. And I ain't gonna hold y'all no longer. Let's get to this. About Los Angeles is, uh, is all the plastic surgery. What do you say? I don't get it. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. I gotta admit, the only thing that freaks me out about Los Angeles is, uh, is all the plastic surgery. I don't get it. Bro, I live in L.A., man. Yeah, it's bad out here. Just go to Santa Monica, go to Beverly Hills, go to Malibu, go to Hollywood. It gets bad. It gets real bad. I used to work, be a personal trainer at Equinox. Equinox is a gym that's like famous people go there. Like Magic Johnson went to my gym, a bunch of NBA players. Nelly went to my gym, Terrell Owens, some rappers, all that stuff. It's a super high-end gym. I used to be a trainer there. But I tell you, the plastic surgery runs rampant. Rampant. It's everywhere in that gym. You can't even... It's crazy, bro. L.A. is the same. Why do people get plastic surgery? You know? Why can't you just admit it's over? <laughs> you know? You had your time. Stop trying to look fuckable in your 50s. Uh, for real, it's over. It's weird. With their faces yanked back. Looking all shiny, right? <laughs> Not to mention they haven't even figured it out face be stuck you know why would you get a facelift can't you look at other facelifts and realize they haven't worked all the bugs out yet <laughs> all right that's what you want to look like like you just lost a fight three days ago don't be a hero let somebody else go in there take the fight be looking like this hi be stuck stuck looking like a clown looking goofy Looking hella goofy. Fucking bitch. Look, some women get it done. You know, they get the they, they get the Kim K. They pay it or whatever. You know, you almost can't tell. They get the they get the Kylie Jenner. It's not terrible, but most of the times it's pretty bad. Let's keep you, it real. you lay back, wait it out. They're just lying to people. Oh no, looks great. It looks great. Put a little ice on it. We'll see you in a couple weeks. All right, take it easy. Jesus Christ, what the fuck happened? <laughs> we followed every step. Did we miss something? Oh, hey, 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 oh, here's your keys, here's your keys. There you go, there you go. I almost didn't recognize you, you look so young. All right, take it easy. She gone? All right, she's gone. All right, shred everything, shred it. No, you're nuts. You wait it out, let them figure it out, then you fucking go in. Don't be a goddamn hero, you know? Look at hair plugs. Hair plugs don't look half bad now. Saw this guy the other night on TV. He's like, oh, God, I wish I did this 10 years ago. It's like, no, you don't. <laughs> 10 years ago, when they were stapling ant legs to the top of people's heads. Remember that? Your eyes would water looking at their hairline. Like, is that, is that sewn in? I see pine tar. <laughs> they used to put you in like a headlock. Hold still. Use like a nail gun. Hold still. Guys would tap out after a row and a half. Fuck it. I don't give a shit. <laughs> <laughs> you wish you got hair plugs 10 years ago. Do you wish you got polio 60 years ago? <laughs> what else is on your wish list, sir? <laughs> no, you don't fuck stupid. with your face. Okay? I understand liposuction. They screw that up. You can put on a shirt. Right? Hey, real talk. There's certain places you don't play with. There's no shirt for your real face. Real talk. Who do they think they're fooling with their stupid, you know? 
And then you lie to yourself. I'm just going to do it. I'm just going to do this. Just going just gonna, to just gonna have this done. No, you're not. You're not. What are you, you're just going to wax the fender on your car? Then that's it. And the rest of it looks all shitty. Well, maybe I'll just do the hood. And maybe I'll do the back. That's how it happens. Then you look like one of those real housewives. Like, face all twisted up. <laughs> Looking crazy. Fucking idiots. Do I look? They are. They're idiots. Do they look like I'm in my 20s? No. You look weird. You look fucking <laughs> weird. You still look like you're in your 50s. I just can't guess what year anymore because I've never seen that year. I've never seen that shiny fucking look. It's almost like you discovered a new age between 52 and 53. Yeah. People, there's nothing wrong with being 52 and looking 52. All right, you're 52. You didn't get fucked. Yeah. What would you rather be? Yo, man. A natural 52 most of the time gonna look better than some overly facelifted 52, bro. That's all I'm saying, bro. Y'all, if y'all never seen it, bro, you gotta live somewhere where they be where this plastic, bro. Across the street from the gym I worked at, there there was literally a plastic surgery like clinic place or some shit, bro. They would literally go there, come looking different, looking different. I don't know, bro. I don't 52. Know and look 52 or be 52 and look like a 28 year old lizard. <laughs> I, that's your options at this point. Oh, bro, he's crazy. He's crazy. You know what's really- Facts though. It's really like actually uh, embarrassing is that the facelift, that's predominantly a white problem. 100%. You notice that? I've never seen a black person with a facelift ever. Other than like the Jacksons, but they're all out of their minds, right? Because <laughs> their dad made him rehearse all day and sleep in the fireplace. <laughs> like jamming all nine. Get in there, you bastards! No hugs, no kisses. His face permanently twisted up from 50 years of screaming, Sing, motherfucker! <laughs> <laughs> <It's not> <laughs> <laughs> that's, that's terrible, bro. Why do he do? That's terrible. Why he do Michael like that? And Janet. And all and the rest of them, man, god damn. Tito. <laughs> oh, shit. His dad was crazy, though. Rest in peace, Michael, man. Hey, do you know why so many whiteies need facelifts? I love that word. I'm trying to bring it back. <laughs> <laughs> I love it. It's funny. Whitey! <laughs> you know why? Do you know why so many Caucasians need facelifts? Because we don't know about lotion. Facts. See that? Only half of you laughed. That should have been everybody. <laughs> yeah, but a lot of you were sitting there like, well, what about Lowe's? <laughs> what is this? Bro. Bro. Oh, my God, bro. When I used to go, bro. So, I went to uh, a lot of schools. I always went to school in Santa Monica. So, I got a lot of, I got like a good amount of like white, like white friends, white homies and shit. And so, when I would go to their house, right? <laughs> I go to their house, bro. If you black, you know this, bro. Or if you got black friends, we got lotion 24-7 all the time, no matter what. That shit in the car, it's in at the house, it's in the car. Sometimes it's in the backpack, you know what I mean? Like, when I was elementary school, I had to carry lotion on me just in case. I had to carry it on me in the backpack just in case. It got crazy on the playground. Anyways, you go to the white friend's house, right? go whatever y'all playing games whatever you go play in the you you in the pool swimming or something you know whatever's going on you know what i mean you're playing you're being kids and then you you're, you stay the night or something or whatever anyways at some point you're gonna need some lotion as a real as a real in you really you know what i'm saying really gonna need some lotion really gonna need that see you see there ain't no gray there's a reason there ain't no gray you feel me there ain't no gray because we be ready out here you feel me you know what i'm saying got that cocoa cocoa Coco, bro. Anyways, we ready out here. So, uh, go to their house, right? You be like, hey, man, y'all got some lotion? You a little kid, you asking the kid, you asking the, the mom, the, and they're like, lotion? For what? <laughs> <laughs> you be like, you, you got some lotion? They be like, for what? You be like, I'm gray, bro. I'm, 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 I'm decaying out here. I'm gray. I'm turning gray. I need some lotion ASAP. I can't go outside. I can't go outside in public without this. <laughs> Y'all better go buy some at the store, but I don't know. <laughs> For real. 
I'll be like, I used to, this when I was real, you know, I used to ask my, my white hunks, like, you not ashy? And they would look at their legs. Or they would look at their arms. And they not ashy. And I'm like, shit. You ashy, but you can see mine, though. That's the difference. <laughs> <laughs> Slow shoes oh, speak shit. of, and what is the magic, Darren? That shit is real. Just to put it out there, you can use lotion on other parts of your body besides your dick. <laughs> exactly, exactly. <laughs> you ever wondered why your dick still looks brand new, but the rest of you is starting to look like an aging pirate? Because you need to increase the circumference of the lotion distribution. <laughs> All right, you got skin everywhere. Go on, check yourself out. The bottom of your feet look like a prehistoric riverbed. <laughs> That's not part of the natural aging process. You dry it out. I'm not judging you. I'm not judging anybody. I didn't know anything about lotion. Never used it the first 33 years of my life. Never used it. Till one night I was going out with this black girl, right? She was getting ready and she was just putting that shit on everywhere. Just slathering it on. I thought she had like a rash or something. I'm like, what do they got, like poison ivy? She was getting silky. She was getting silky smooth, buddy. That's the secret. That is the secret. Cocoa butter. Cocoa butter. That's the secret. So he's silky. With you. She goes, no, I'm just making sure I'm not ashy. I said, ashy? She goes, dry skin. I went, wow. I guess I freaked her out a little bit because I was like, wow. Oh. <laughs> She's like, well, white people get ashy too. I was like, yeah, you know, I, I don't think we do. Yeah, I've been alive for 33 years. No one has ever said, hey, Bill, uh, you look a little ashy. I never even heard that word until you said it. She's like, you're an idiot. Stick out your arm. So I stick out my arm, and ever so gently, she just drags her nails down. This smoke starts coming up. It's like pastry <laughs> flakes flying off, track marks. She's signing her name. She's like, you see that? She goes, that's ashy. You're ashy? Freak me out. I'm like, holy shit, I'm ashy. <laughs> I didn't know. You just can't see it, bro. You just can't see it. That's all. It. All I knew was that I always got itchy in the winter. <laughs> Couldn't figure it out. Always got itchy in the winter. What the fuck do I get itchy? I thought it meant the bath towel was dirty. That's what I thought. And I would change it out and put a fresh one. Now I'm going to be okay. Take a shower, dry off, fucking itching again. God damn it. I hate the winter. <laughs> see that? That's why you got to hang out with everybody. Facts. Yeah. You learn stuff. There's too much information in the world, and every group of people misses a little bit. 100%. White people totally missed the lotion seminar at some point in history. I don't know if it's because we can't see it. You know, black people get ashy. It looks like they like leaned up against a chalkboard or something. <laughs> you know, they can see it. They miss it. Their friends help them out. Like, look at your ashy motherfucking elbow. Hell what yeah. Wrong with you? Hell right? yeah. Hell yeah. We miss that Look shit the way black shit. people miss the whole register your weapons summit. <laughs> <laughs> Just never got the information. The amount of rappers who've been busted for the unregistered Glock in the car Crazy. just blows my mind. Crazy. It's like, why would you do that to yourself? Do you just want to make an album over the phone? Is that what it is? Is that like the new auto-tune or some shit? I don't know. No, it breaks my heart every time I see it. I just think, God, if he just had one white friend. If he just had one white friend in his entourage, the dude would have been sitting there going like, is that thing registered? <laughs> you out of your mind? Get it out of there. Get it out of there. Yeah, it's illegal. That's like fucking three to five mandatory. <laughs> how, do you, how do you not know that? That's the question. How do you not fucking know that? This guy's got an unregistered weapon in the car. Like, we're just going to go driving around with it. It's just, it's just ridiculous. <laughs> this motherfucker's See, funny. there you go, all right? You don't need a facelift, okay? Lay off the booze, do some cardio, moisturize. You're gonna be fine, okay? Don't believe in these myths. Black don't crack, it's bullshit. They all put lotion on like every 20 minutes during the day. It's ridiculous. They all get a giant oil drum with a shit at home. Every morning they wake up, they dump themselves in it, shake themselves <laughs> off, and walk out the door absolutely glistening. Glistening? glistening. White guys like me are walking around, no hat on. Hey, let's go sailing. <laughs> Passing out face down in the sand. 
That's funny, bro. Hey, man, that was Bill Burr plastic surgery and lotion, man. I, I I hope that wasn't too long, man. I couldn't find the original clip, but that was still funny as hell, bro. Very entertaining. I enjoyed myself. I hope you did too. Continue to send me more uh comedic, funny stuff. I love these reactions, man. I, I just be having a good time, and y'all seem to be doing the same from the comments I'm reading, man. I if y'all here to support it, I'm here to support that right back. You know what I mean? So I love y'all. Appreciate y'all. Keep it real, 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 real. Always reach everyone. Till next time. Peace.